structure is intriguing. We should examine it further, if possible. Systems are running as optimal. All we need now is the power. Ugh, good work. Let's get to headquarters now. We'll leave the rest of the auto systems. Let's see what this will do. If we can get this shielding technology to work, we're one big step forward. You don't often meet other people here. So, do you want to tell me who you are and where you came from? Abessa or Ignadon? Neither. Ignadon is one way, and Abessa is the other. There is no other way you came here. So, try again. Which direction did you come from, Abessa or Ignadon? From Ignadon. Really? Tell me. Did you happen to come across a suggester called Rainer during your travels? He's out there searching for new recruits and is supposed to report here. But we've gone through an entire cycle here and haven't heard from him. So, have you seen Rainer? Yes. Really? Do you know what he's been doing out there for so long? Like you said already, he's looking for new recruits. Good to know. Thank you for the information. So, with that out of the way, what brings you here? What are you doing out here? Force recon. We're making sure the Albs don't try to attack Ignadon through Abessa. Well, pff, we were. We just lost one of our OBS posts to Reavers. So the question is, do we stay or do we go? Until our commander decides if we're taking the post back or hightailing it home, our mission is on hold. 
Who are you? My name is Egon. I'm a cleric legate from Ignadon. Loyal to the Horde, unlike the other clerics here in the Bessa. I mean, if the ones in the Dome City would lend a hand, end of problem. You think some of your team are loyal? My team? No way. These clerics are sworn to Kalan and the Hort. The clerics in the Dome City haven't been true clerics for some time now. They've started believing Ebessa is a state. I've heard they're even letting Albs into their city. We're trying to protect Magalan from Albs, and they're busy setting up house with them. Sounds like you don't get along too well with them. What are you doing out here? Are you looking to trade? Answer now, or I'll start to think you're one of those damned Reavers. I'm not a Reaver. Really? You have proof of that? No. No? I suppose you wouldn't. Then tell me what you're doing here. Why are you here? Force Recon. We're keeping an eye on what's going on here in Abessa. We can't match the Albs for numbers. But if we can predict where they'll attack, then we can focus our forces where they are needed and make them pay. If we bloody their noses, it'll buy us time. You're certain the Albs will attack you? Conquest is in their DNA. Power, conquest, and destruction is all they want. So we'll stop them here before they can reach Ignadon. If all else fails, we'll draw them here and then blow the dam. Water will hit the Albs with the force of Kalan's fist, leaving none behind. Won't flooding a Bessa kill innocent people? This is a war for the soul of Magalan. If we must sacrifice the few for the many, then so be it. We cannot allow ourselves to be weak in the face of this enemy. None of this counts for anything until we can bring these Reavers under control. What's the problem with the Reavers? Beyond their normal raiding, it... So, one of their raids has put a hole in our plans. You see, the explosives on the dam need to be triggered by two key-coded detonators, so as to prevent any... accidents. Problem is that in one of their raids, the Reavers got their hands on the second detonator. Until we get it back, we can't trigger the dam. The Moral Dilemma. Are all means justified in war? Moral dilemmas tend to go out of the window quickly when you're under fire from people who want to feed you into a converter. What happens if the Reavers detonate the bombs? They can't. Like I said, it takes both detonators to blow the dam, and they've only got one. Right now, neither of us can trigger the explosives. They caught us by surprise. A mass attack on one of our positions. In the panic, the detonator got left behind. Do the Reavers know what they have? I doubt it. They probably would have tried to ransom it to us. It's probably on the table exactly where it was left, at least for now. So, we have to figure out how we can force the Reavers out of our fueling station so we can recapture the detonator. And we have to do it before the Alps attack, or they discover our plan. Do you have a plan of attack? Yes, but I'm more concerned about what happens after it. We've only got six clerics to man two monitoring posts, three on each side of the dam. We can attack, but I can't afford to take any casualties. Where are these Reavers located? As far as we know, they're still at the fueling station. We've not seen them leave those ruins since they took them. We were using it as a monitoring post until we were overrun. It's across there, at the other side of the dam. What would you pay me if I could solve your problem? Wouldn't knowing you've helped the free people of Abessa be enough? No? Well, there will be plenty of loot to be gained from the Reavers. That should be encouragement enough. What sort of loot? Well, they're Reavers. They must have collected loot for themselves. That's what they do. I'll take care of the Reavers for you. Do you really think you can take them all on? 
Well, if you think you can take them on, then I wish you luck. Will you join us on this attack? With you along, I know we can do this. No. I'll attack alone. You really think you can take them on alone? I hope your skill matches your courage. Good luck. If you don't come back, we will know what happened. That was remarkable. Not now. I must remember this place. I would have liked to see the old world as it was before the comet. Judging by the structure of this box, and the host attached to it, it is seen to have once been some sort of primitive food release system. People probably held their plates under the hoses to receive their portion of protein porridge. I wonder what it tasted like. That one's mine. Stay safe in the wilderness. Desperate times lead to desperate actions. But don't be fooled by the lies of Tavar. They talk of freedom, of profit, of fun, of sex, good times and beer. But all that Tavar has to offer is chemicals, exploitation, and a lonely drunk. Only Kalan knows the Join us and find yourself. This is me. Broadcasting from the order to bring a warning to all people. This is a dangerous area.
I would like to return someday. The Reavers are all dead. The land must have been watching over us today. We will send a message to Ignodon. Hopefully this time they'll send us the reinforcements we need. If we can hold these monitoring posts, we can hold Abesha. Take anything you find on the Reavers. You've earned it.